Hello everyone, this is Nana Matari here. I am meditation coach and trainer. In this video, I would like to share my opinion of the damages and consequences of COVID-19. There are three main damages what COVID did with us. First, COVID destroyed our confidence. Most of the people are now suffering from acute stress and anxiety and nobody really know how to come out of this situation. Second, COVID destroy the trust among people. We used to shake hands and hug the strangers, and now we have to wear our mask and stay at the distance. It built a lot of mistrust and deep loneliness inside of our heart. The third damage is it destroy our vision of our world. We used to live in the world where we can travel to different parts of the world easily. Right now, there are many restrictions around the world and we cannot travel to other countries very easily. We lost our freedom of exploration. Like any other events, there are negative consequences and positive consequences. There are two negative consequences of COVID-19. First, people are suffering from depression. It is due to the many series of traumatic experience since the beginning of 2020, a lot of people are suffering from that depression. The second is that many people are in conflicts and in pain. A lot of people think that taking vaccine is the solution and blaming the one who doesn't take the vaccine. And other people think that we should not take the vaccine and promote or support the materialistic world anymore so that we can find the new world which is free from materialism. In my opinion, vaccine is not the solution or blaming other people is not the solution. We are just seeing our pains and anger in other people. There are also three positive consequences of COVID-19. The first is the deep depression means we are in deep rest. Depression means deep rest of our own psyche. Like any depression of our history, depression is a shift in our perspective. We'll be able to find a new way of behaving and a new way of being by having the depression. So the second fact is we could now connect or build relationship with people from all corners of the world because of our technology. That is why we can build brain trust and find out the real solution within a short period of time. And the third is that we have to focus our attention into the inside world rather than the outside world. It makes us think the very important spiritual questions like, who am I? What am I doing here? But with that, we will understand our deep nature and we will understand our power. And we will understand that we are the creator of our own world. From that wisdom, we'll be able to recreate a peaceful world. Are you ready to do that? See you next time with my video.